Tara Lee and John Brummett. Yes, uh, uh, there's going to be a bunch of vendor booths that are catered towards kids and doing a lot of uh, different events. Hey guys, this is Ro coming at you from the Salt Palace. We're getting ready for uh, this year's Salt Lake City Fan Experience event, coinciding with Salt Lake City Comic Con. Now, we're here in this main ballroom because we just went ahead and finished training hundreds, literally hundreds of people for this event. Uh, all the volunteers in one place, it's the first time they've all been together. Uh, what we do is we create kind of a structure, a hierarchy, so the czars are going to be the, the top management and then we have team leads and then we have crew members and the czars essentially are uh, the facilitators of the entire area. They're assigned to a location and they're ultimately responsible for the success of that location. So for example if they're assigned to a panel room uh, the czars are going to be responsible for making sure the panel runs smoothly, the celebrity guests get what they need, uh, that they're treated with respect, that the, the room is filled and then emptied uh, in a timely manner. And they're also there to, to help out with the team leads. So they give the team leads their breaks, they kind of direct the team leads. I am a czar, so I will be helping out from a leadership standpoint, making sure that everything goes off without a hitch and that the fans of Comic-Con love every minute of it and that it's no stress for them. Their primary reward is just exhaustion, bruised feet, worn out shoes, and hunger. That's all they get, really and the team leads are kind of the middlemen between the czars and the crew members. And the crew members are the ones that basically do all the grunt work. They're the, they're the men on the ground, they're slinging in the mud. Crew members are going to be doing line management, uh, making sure that all the attendees are having a good time and you know enjoying themselves but also doing so safely. Then the team leads, get a, they work an entire day, uh, one full day open and close, and then they'll get to go and see the rest of the show uh, on us because, I mean, that's a... That's a big, you know, a big time commitment. And then each of the crew members are going to be there for at least half a day. And then they get to go get to watch the rest of the show for the other half a day. If you don't have your tickets, get them now because this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. If you've never been, this is something to check off on your list of things you have to do in your lifetime. So come on down to FanX. We're going to have a great time. It's actually bigger than Salt Lake Comic Con last September was. We already are way ahead in ticket sales. It's and we broke all kinds of records with uh, last September's Comic-Con, so we're looking to do even better this time. We actually opened up the entire Salt Palace, so it's not just half of the, the venue. It's double the size to provide for all sorts of room for all sorts of activities. We want to make sure we take care of the guests as much as possible, and everybody has an awesome time when they get here. So hope to see you guys out here at FanX, and this is the Behind the Scenes.